Welcome to Music City Gospel Review, the voice he hears. I'm your host, and my name is Renee Lee. We're coming to you from Nashville, Tennessee. Our studio's right here, and every time we film, I get more and more excited because the singers are just outdoing themselves, and they are excited to be here today to sing just for you. It's all about gospel music in the house, and uh, we have today the lineup. Sheila Reed from Dalton, Georgia. Randy Ken Cannon from Etowah, Tennessee. From Cookville, Tennessee, is Susan Guerin. And from right here in Nashville, Terry Weeks. Some of you may have heard of him. Now we're going to go to the set and listen to Sheila Reed saying, The Lord's watching over you. Yes, the Lord's watching over me. That raging water covers me. Yes, my Lord's, Lord's watching over me. When I'm down and blue and all alone, yes, my Lord's, Lord's watching over me. When I'm miles away and far from home, yes, my Lord's, Lord's watching over me. Yes, my Lord's, Lord's watching over me. That raging water covers me. Yes, my Lord's watching over me. Yes, my Lord's watching over me. When I toss on my stormy sea, and that raging water covers me. Yes, my Lord's watching over me. Nothing's going wrong, yes, my Lord's, Lord's watching, watching over me. I'll just give him a praise and sing him a song, yes, my Lord's, Lord's watching, watching over me. Yes, my Lord's, Lord's watching, watching over me. When I toss the my stormy sea, and that raging water covers me. Lord's watching over me. Yes, my Lord's watching over me. When I'm tossed on my stormy sea, and that raging water covers me. Yes, my Lord's watching over me. And that raging water covers me. Yes, my Lord's watching over me. Amen. The Lord's watching over me. It sure is. <laughs> <laughs> Sheila Reed, ladies and gentlemen. Thank you for having me today. I appreciate it. Well, you so jumped much. me to it. I was going to say, thank <laughs> you for coming to Nashville, Tennessee. Well, I'm just so glad to be here. I know. We're so excited to have you. You're I'm so excited special. about a lot of things. Praise the Lord. <laughs> well, why don't you share with us what's well, on your uh, thoughts today? We're, we're going to be having our uh, award show October the 5th at uh, Colonnade in Ringo, Georgia. And we want to invite everybody to come be with us. Um, I know that National Spotlight and National Review has been nominated. Isn't that wonderful? Wow. So uh, I have Gospel Music Express Showcase. And we work with gospel artists all year long. And, um, and I'm just so pleased to do that. It makes me happy when I make somebody else happy. Sheila helps a lot of singers, and if you're watching out there and you're a singer and uh, you love singing gospel music, country gospel, southern gospel, contemporary, hip-hop gospel, anything with yes. Christian lyrics, she has. she's the president of Gospel Music Express yes. and sure um, has an online magazine. You just have all kinds of entities, the online magazine. Well. We can never get enough advertisement. That's right. We want to be okay. out there working for the Lord daily. So yes. uh, it's called GME. What's Showcase. the website to that? Showcase.com. My GME Showcase. No, just GME Showcase.com. And folks can pull us up and listen to all type of artists, uh, gospel artists that's on there. And um, 
They're all better than I am, I'm telling you. Oh, listen to you. <laughs> You're a wonderful singer. Well, and a lot of people compare her to Vestal Goodman. Oh, my goodness. And uh, yes, they do, don't they? They do. Yes. And, um, now, did you write that song that you just performed? Yes. Um, she's a great songer, sing, uh, singwriter. I'll talk in a minute. Singer, okay. songwriter. <laughs> I'm so excited talking to her. Um, but she's a great promoter and helps a lot of artists. And I can't say enough if uh, she's here performing today, but we want to plug what she does for the artist. Now, you also have Harvest Outreach. Yes, which uh, is a food program. Yes. And we take pride in um, feeding our elderly in our communities of North Georgia, and that's where our heart's at, and that's where our focus is at right now. And you've done that for how many years? Oh, this is my 27th year. Yes. And um, you have a, a heart to help people um, who are less fortunate, and you do a Christmas program, a Thanksgiving program, and yes. so many other things. Now, Sheila's going to be performing another song in just a few minutes, but what is your personal website also? Um, HarvestOutreachCenter.com on our ministry okay. there. So um, they'll get to see how we feed folks and and how we go about our services, and um, and I think they'll enjoy that as well. Okay. She's going to sing us another song in just a moment with some friends, so yes. stay tuned. On the set with Sheila Reed again with friends Randy Ken Cannon and Terry Weeks to sing This Is Just What Heaven Means to Me. A country where no twilight shadows deep On ending day where night will never be A city where no storm clouds cannot gather Oh, this is just what heaven Randy Ken Cannon singing, I'm going back. I'm going back to the old time religion. Going back to the old rugged cross. Going back to the time when my soul. 
soul was on fire when the church winning the lost. Well, the old saints before us would come to God's house, preach and they'd sing all day long. They'd lift up the hands and run the aisles. Then they would sing victory songs. I'm going back to the old time religion, going back to the old rugged cross, going back to the time when my soul was on fire, when the church was winning the laws. Well, why should I sit with my hands in my lap, never stand up? to testify God's been good to me just like he was to them that's when they'd all start to cry going back to the old time religion going back to the old rugged cross going back to the time when my soul was on fire the church winning the laws. I'm going back to the old time religion. Going back to the old rugged cross. Going back to the time when my soul was on fire. When the church winning the laws. When the church was winning the when the church was winning the law. That's right, brother. We just Amen. need to go back, don't we? Yes, we do. Randy Ken Cannon, ladies and gentlemen. And we were just talking about this this week about how, you know, we need to go back to the cross, Calvary, from the messages in the pulpit uh, instead of motivational, positive messages. Those are great, make you feel good, but it's all about Jesus and the cross. That's right. There's a lot of, you know, and, and I could really start preaching when I start talking about this song, yes. but I won't. Uh, but it's just it. a good message that the Lord gave me when he gave me this song about 20 years ago. And actually, this was recorded here in Nashville. Eddie Crook himself was playing the piano on that on that wow. soundtrack uh, when we recorded that. But there's a little old preacher was preaching, and he said, you know, I can remember when, and he mentioned several denominations, used to shout and praise the Lord and run the aisles, and he said, it's time we get back to that old-time religion. As soon as he said that, the Lord gave me that song. And it's That's time. That's a great song, Amen. too. And you write a lot of your, do you write all of them? I write, them? yeah, just about everything that I sing. I write most of my music songs, mm -hmm. and uh, uh, I, I, God has given me a gift to write, I think, beautiful songs. And, and I just love to sing. I grew up in a church where they told us, if God's called you to sing, we're not going to beg you. If we're going to ask you about two times, and that's it. So you don't have to beg me to sing. That's right. <laughs> and you have a great voice, too. You're a blessing. I was really uh, feeling the Holy Spirit and being blessed over there listening to you sing. Now, you minister as well. You preach revivals. Mm -hmm. And tell us a little bit about I do. That. Well, I preach. I've been preaching off and on. For years, most of my preaching ministry was in nursing homes jails and street corners uh i've just kind of moved into churches in the last few years and that's a totally different thing i think i enjoy preaching in the jails and street corners better well you were obeying the word of god that says <laughs> go ye therefore Amen. you know we're supposed to go out from the four walls of the church that's and take right. the gospel to the folks mm -hmm. so um tell us about your family okay i have three wife, sons my wife yvonne is with me I have three sons and two grandsons. We weren't supposed to be able to have any kids at all, according to the doctors, but, but God always has the last word. And so we're raising a four-year-old grandson right now, and he just registered for school yesterday. Uh, and Lewis is at home, and he's just my joy. Shout uh, out to Lewis yes, out there. Yes, hello, Lewis. <laughs> keeps me happy and keeps me worn out and tired all the time at the yes. same time. But um, we love to go sing and just preach whatever God wants us to do. That's what we want to do. Well, it touched my heart when your wife was with you. She came up to Nashville with you. So um, tell the ladies and gentlemen out there how to get in touch with you if they want you to come sing or preach at their church. Okay. Uh, you can, I, I haven't done anything on my website lately, so I'm not even going to tell We haven't added anything. But my email address is randykincannon 
at att.net. And my cell phone number is 423-333-0725. Okay, call him. And he's going to sing another song that you wrote called. You're worthy of all my praise. Randy King Cannon. Amen. Oh, Lord. Oh, Lord. You're worthy of all my praise. Oh, Lord. Oh, Lord. Worthy of all my praise, oh Lord, oh Lord. Worthy of all my praise, oh Lord, oh Lord. You're worthy of praise. When I was down in Egypt's land, you're worthy of all my praise. You brought me out with a mighty hand, worthy of all my praise. Oh Lord, oh Lord, worthy of all my praise. Oh Lord, oh Lord, you're worthy of praise. Yeah, you picked me up when I was down. You're worthy of all my praise. And you set my feet on the solid ground. Worthy of all my praise. Oh Lord, oh Lord. Worthy of all my praise, oh Lord, oh Lord, you're worthy of praise. You saved my soul when I was lost, you're worthy of all my praise. When you died upon that cross, worthy of all my praise, oh Lord, oh Lord, worthy of all my praise. of all my praise and you wrote my name on the heavenly road worthy of all my praise oh lord oh lord you're worthy of all my praise oh lord oh lord you're worthy of praise Up next, we have Susan Gehring singing Wayfair and Stranger. I am a poor wayfair and stranger while traveling through this world of woe. But there's no sickness, there's no toil, no in that bright land to which I go, I'm going there to see my little mama. I'm going there, no more to roam, for I'm just
in concert with that blood washed band and I want to cast my crown of glory at Jesus' feet when I get to that land cause I'm going ladies and gentlemen, and that song talks about going home and, you know, there's rest for the weary, the wayfaring stranger, and I thought about how we're all going to meet in heaven one day, our mom and dad and right. all those people. That's our hope in it Christ is. Jesus. It is. That's I'm, what we're singing about. My daddy died on March the 29th in 2006. Mother died on May the 20th, 2006, and her brother got killed on August the 1st, 2006. We were talking about rough, that. But then I had three grandbabies born about two months yes. later. So cycle of life goes on, and the Lord is good, and he blesses. Yes. Now, um, how long have you been singing? I've been singing since I was 10 years old, but I wasn't until I was 50 that the Lord started dealing with me, wanting me to do this. And I said, well, Lord, you know I would, but I don't sing that well. I don't really play anything you sing that well. I can't remember the words. And I weighed 323 pounds at the time, and physically I just wasn't able to stand there Look and do you. it. Look at you. You're but not Lord, 320 pe- If it wasn't now. for that, I would do that for you. In less than a year, I'd lost 187 pounds. I now have a recording studio. I can change keys. I can remember the words to about 140 songs that I have backups to. And I said, Lord, where you want me to go? I'm Listen time. at what God can do. Amen. What he's done for her, he will yeah, do for amen. you. Don't challenge him. That's <laughs> <laughs> if you're not ready to go, don't challenge him. That's true. Oh, my mm-hmm. gosh. This is just a wonderful testimony yes, of what the Lord is it's able to so do. so good to me. What is your favorite song to sing? Is it the one you just performed? Yeah, Wayfair and Stranger. I've always loved that song, and I came across this backup just digging through uh, some of the different sites that you can go to to get them, and I just like that version of it. I've got a few things that I'm working on at songs and stuff, but I'm not ready to do those just yet. But now, you write as well. I do a little, do a little, but uh, I do have a recording studio. I'm learning to record yes. myself as well as other people. And uh, I won uh, Gospel CD of the Year at uh, Tennessee Country Gospel Music Association, which blowed me away. I was Aww. just so, I'm, it lets me know I'm on the right track anyway. Well, and it gets you started toward it a does. career. It does, so. and I love it. I love doing all the designing, the graphics and everything. I'm mm-hmm. taking classes to do all of that, too. And yes. Uh, I'm just having a ball in the Lord. That's yes. all there is to it. Well, you know, th- you're never too late um, no, to no. start singing for Jesus. No. Nope. And so if people want to get in touch with you about performing, how would they get in touch with you? Okay, I do have a website, www.susie.com. Okay. uh, Or S-U-Z as in zebra, Y-3-A at Yahoo. And she'll come sing for you or she'll she'll record you. Yeah. So I uh, just want to promote the gospel. Yes. I, that's what I want to record other people. I want to help people that just sing in church, wants to do some for their family and friends, as well as groups if they want to do that. That's fine, Great. too. She's going to sing us another song. And the name of it? Uh, Stand by the River with okay. my grandbabies, okay. Griffin and Autumn. Susan Gear. <laughs> The road's been long, I'm a little bit weary. A lot of miles behind me, home's a lot nearer. I got one more cross then, she's a long ways over. Come on and stand by the river, waiting for me. Come on and stand by the river, Lord, and hold my trembling hand. 
Cradle me, sweet Jesus, from the cold dark sinking sand. This one trip can't take alone. Lord, I'm anxious to get on home. So stand by the river waiting for me. Paved the road through the hills and the mountains. In the middle of the desert, Lord, you made me a fountain. Come stand by me, Jesus. To the cold, deep water, come on and stand by the river, wait for me. Stand by the river, Lord, and hold my trembling hand. Cradle me, sweet Jesus, from the cold, our sinking sands. This is one trip I can't take alone. Lord, I'm anxious to get on home, so stand by the river, wait for me. Stand by the river, Lord. Hold my trembling hand. Cradle me, sweet Jesus, from the cold dark sinking sand. This one trip I can't take alone. Lord, I'm ready to get on home. So stand by the river. Stand by the river. Stand by the river. Wait for me. Oh, Lord. Stand by the river. Waiting for me. Why don't you stand by the river? Stand by the river, Lord. Stand by the river. Waiting for me. Wow. That's all I can say about today's program. Wow. We've had some great guests recently, and today was no exception to the rule. I know you enjoyed every one of these singers. Send us an email and let us know that you watched. Um, send us one through the website, www.musiccitygospelreview.com. We have a brand-new website. You can watch reruns of previous episodes there. Uh, we'll get in touch with the artist if you don't find them on the Internet and let them know what you thought about their singing. And just remember, they're singing, singing about Jesus Christ, and I hope that you know him today. He loves you more than you'll ever know. Thank you for tuning in and watching this. Goodbye. <laughs>